Hello YouTube! Haggis again with just a bunch of nerds and today I'm bringing you Boromir. What? No, not Boromir? Fine. Ned Stark. This is Funko's Game of Thrones Legacy Collection number 6 and Haggis's toy review number 12. So let's take a look at the packaging. Our standard Legacy Collection packaging, sigil on the bottom, name, list of who's in the series, and photo still. Alright, let's take a look at this picture. Picture? Figure? Uh, once again, the detailing is exquisite. Good detail on his leather armor you can see all the clasps the uh, belt buckle all the roping on the uh, scabbard uh, detailing is real good nicely sculpted figurehead is sculpted really good just like Sean Bean uh, he's even got the uh, hand of the uh, Kingpin. Kingpin. No, not the big fat guy from Marvel. Um, his two accessories are his big R sword ice, which is let's say the biggest sword of any figure I've ever seen for this scale. So I like it. And regular long sword Mark B. That's its official name. I've named it. Take that. For articulation, his head is on a ball joint. He can look pretty good. His hair doesn't really get in the way. No, he can't look up too much. His um ooh. Here's a lesson. Play with your figures before you review them. Because this is tight. And I'm probably going to break something. But his sh on a shoulder. His shoulder is. I don't know. Maybe this one isn't on. Oh, yeah, it is. On a ball joint. There you go. Always dip them in some hot water. Loosen those joints up. His uh, elbow is on a ball joint. No. Humans can naturally do this. Don't worry about it. His uh, wrist is on a swivel. He does have waist articulation right there at the belt line, which is good. He has ball jointed hips, an upper thigh swivel, 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 double jointed knee, which I can show you if his armoring in the way. Double jointed knee, no shin swivel, ankle swivel, and ankle pivot. No rockers. Really, really enjoy this line. I can't praise this line enough. Uh, for size comparison, here he is with his bastard son. Jon Snow and our usual culprit Carnage the Hound and he's decided to wear a helmet and you know I've done enough of these videos I should be able to get him to stand on the first shot shouldn't I there you go so he's fairly in line I don't know. I don't know why he's a little bit shorter than Jon Snow. I would have made him a little bit bigger, but that's just me. And again, Jon Snow's young. He's old. He's starting to shrink. Because once you hit a certain age, you shrink. All right. But um, that is the first wave of uh, Funko's Game of Thrones. I'll have the second wave up for you shortly as well. Go through them one by one. Um... I'd like to thank Nerdhaven Collectibles for uh, 
donating the figure so we can uh, review it. I'd like to also like to ask you to like the video, follow us on Twitter. Again, like us, like the video, comment, and subscribe. Uh, share the video, get the word out. We're working on more board game reviews, more board game unboxings. We'll probably get a Let's Play out there one of these days. So once again, this is Haggis with Just a Bunch of Nerds. Uh, signing off. And don't worry, for our three-year anniversary, we might even have um, Firefly reviewed. <laughs>